Hi Scorpio, welcome to your full Sturgeon Moon Secret Confessions reading. Thanks for joining me, my name is Michelle and this is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Scorpio, I'm tapping into an energy of a person that is in and around your energetic field uh, for the time period for around the, uh, the full Sturgeon Moon and or it's the grain moon I'm, I'm going for more of the uh, the well-known term here which is the sturgeon moon of course it has uh, a watery kind of influence for uh, for fishermen it was an important time in the northern hemisphere to uh, uh, the, the sturgeon would be biting so they would uh, they would get more uh, sturgeon so I'm picking it up as a nourishment, I'm picking it up as uh, an energy of uh, more of an emotional kind of element that I'm picking up also around it. It is also a time of a blue moon and I know a lot of people consider a blue moon to be uh, two full moons in a month. It actually has a wider astronomical scope so it is technically a blue moon. So let's see what's going on here for your person of interest. Now this could be reversed energy as well, Scorpio. So let's take a look for this time period around the full sturgeon moon of August 20th to 22nd, around the uh, the week either side of that time period. Just a shorty update here, guys. Let's see, secret confession from the person that is most on Scorpio's mind secret confession from the person that is most on Scorpio's mind spirit oh gosh the one jumped out I don't know how to manage stress sometimes and I take it out on others I need better stress management skills so I can be the best friend and lover to you that you deserve you make me happy and it's not your responsibility to fix my mistakes okay let's take a look We've got the Nine of Cups in the reverse, the Ace of Pentacles in the reverse, the Five of Swords in reverse, okay. We also have the Knight of Swords, the Ten of Wands in reverse, King of Cups, the Six of Wands, World in reverse, Page of Swords, and the Knight of Wands. Okay, we've got. To, we do have activity. You're one of the uh, the few signs actually that has activity around the, the time of the uh, the Sturgeon Moon so far. Anyway, and I'm up to Scorpio here, doing them in order. Okay. All right. So uh, I'm getting that this person is uh, coming in here. Uh, being honest it, it feels like uh, they're, they're coming in uh, very with the motivation of uh, being very physical uh, with you uh, Scorpio and again this could be reversed energy if you're cross watching for a, uh, a Scorpio with the nine of cups in reverse I feel Scorpio this person is uh, highly uh, tempted by you uh, they're very uh, physically attracted uh, to you this is someone who <sighs> I get that this is, is someone who hmm I don't know how to say this exactly but it, it feels very much like a feast of plenty I'm getting that a feast of plenty the more the better why am I getting that spirit I feel it's okay spirits giving me the six of wands and if you look at all of these cards here with riders on them, riding these dragons, this person has a purpose, very much a goal around the time of the full sturgeon moon. They want to get something locked down. They want to get something, they want to get something, my spirit is, spirit guide is saying. Now, my spirit guide is saying it, it's all to do with ego, with this particular person. Uh, you may be finding this person a bit oppressive, uh, a little bit too much 
I get a, a very full-on energy. Um, they are this very they're under the influence of this very powerful uh, emotional something that's happening in their life that's making them feel emotional some kind of stress that they're experiencing that is actually bringing out a lot of emotion around them okay that's interesting I want to get a card on this ace of uh, Pentacles in reverse because I feel that that's that's the thing here that's causing them this stress so let's see what is this focus the ace of Pentacles in reverse spirit the five of Pentacles it's loss they're feeling left out they don't want to be left out they don't want to be shut out they want to be included so Scorpio this person wants to be included they don't want you to shut them out this person is coming rushing in they feel like there's unfinished business here there's something left on the table that they need to clear up with you I get um, they're, they're looking for a conversation that leads somewhere okay but you're finding it a, a little bit too much Scorpio is, is what I'm getting from spirit so let's see I'm gonna pull some uh, some tea leaves so just be aware that uh, this is someone around you uh, someone who's been around you maybe um, someone that you've been seeing um, they're fearing your loss they're fearing being shut out uh, they're fearing defeat uh, they don't want to walk away being unsuccessful at this uh, this person is looking for ego driven success uh, compliments from an admirer okay so that's what you're going to be getting this person is going to be coming in very complimentary they're waiting for to hear good news from you okay uh, they feel like uh, they well they feel like it's been too slow taught us okay and we've got an empty chair here an empty chair what is this empty chair about spirit disappointment okay they want to fill this ch they, they feel like they can fill a place in your life that may be empty like you have a position available <laughs> it kind of feels like that and um, they're disappointed that it's taking too slow that's what I'm getting they they're hoping that by being very complimentary that they will hear good news from you that's what I'm getting guys um, Scorpio yeah unfinished business I feel like they're, they're coming in they, they, there's gonna be uh, more talk I get more talk about where this is going <sighs> on one hand on one hand I feel uh, like there's not going to be any doubts at the end of this this weekend they want to clear something up my spirit guide is saying I'm gonna, I'm gonna do something a little bit different for you guys I'm going to actually get another secret confession a little bonus one here for you guys special for my beautiful Scorpios because I, I just feel like there's something more uh, what is this this night energy what are they going to come in and say to Scorpio what, what is it that they're going to come in and say to Scorpio spirit what is this what are they going to come in what's this unfinished business what's this unfinished business that this person is going to come in and say to Scorpio spirit <coughs> okay let's see okay all right 
I know it doesn't feel like it sometimes, but I'm always by your side. I'm right there celebrating your successes and comforting you and your losses. I don't always know how to express this to you. Don't ever feel like you are alone. I'm here for you no matter what. Okay, so this person's going to come in saying that they want to be there for you no matter what. They want to be your knight in shining armor. They want to, if you're experiencing any problems, they want to clear up those problems. Yeah, it seems like this person wants to be, to solve your problems. Hmm, interesting. Celebrating your successes, six of wands, comfort in loss. Which I feel is this. Okay. You know, I'm also getting this. It, it feels like this person Okay, it feels very much like attention seeking. Like they want to be there in your life regardless and they, they want to be the person that is the, the person that you go to to fix things. Okay, it's like Mr. Fix-It. I'm getting that. Mr. or Ms. Fix-It. So Scorpio, I'm going to leave it there and wish you all the very best. This is for the time period around the, uh, the Sturgeon Moon, the full moon of August 20th to 22nd for about a week either side of that. So just a quickie here. If you'd like a personal reading, you can email me gypsyinsights at gmail.com or you can go to my Etsy shop. Uh, the link is down below. Gypsy Insights Tarot. Of course, if you're a newcomer, I'd love to have you subscribe. Please do consider hitting that notification bell. Uh, let me know what you're busy manifesting around the full moon, guys, by uh, commenting down below. I'd love to hear from you. And uh, if you are enjoying these readings, please do press that thumbs up, that like button. I'd be so appreciative. It really is very important for my channel. Scorpio, wishing you the best with this. Feel free to check out your other placements. If this one is not for you, it's a general reading, so it won't be for every Scorpio out there. Wishing you the best again. Thanks again for watching, and please take care.